guys and welcome back to another video on the channel and today we're going to be previewing Hull City as they travel to Preston in the second game of the AFL Championship. Let's waste no time, let's get straight into it, let's go. So yeah, um, if we start with how both teams did on the first game of the season then obviously Hull City beat Bristol 2-1 um, which was a very good start coming back from behind, you know, almost like a new team, and that'll do them a world of good. Um, going from behind from a, a goal, and then getting a penalty, and then, you know, um, Seri with a winner. Um, and yeah, Preston drew 0 0 to Wigan, and Preston also without Chad Evans for this game, too, because of a red card. And I've seen it on the highlight show, and it was, a, let's just say, it wasn't the greatest of tackles. Um, so yeah, both teams getting point, point or points on the board, um, which is okay at the start of this time of the season. Um, so yeah, I think you know, the last time Hull travelled to Preston away, um, that was the opening day of the last season, and we won 4-1. Um, so yeah, hopefully we can have a repeat of that. Um, different team now. Um, and yeah, Preston obviously a different manager, Ryan Law. So they're a different team too. Um, yeah, I think they beat us at the KCOM with Cameron Archer, I think, scoring. But he's come back to Aston Villa. So that can be positive for us. Um, so yeah, that's how both teams did. So let's move on to my predicted Hull City team for the game. So, as you can see on the screen, I've got Ingram in goal with a back three of Alfie Jones, Figueredo and Jacob Greaves. Then wing backs have gone for Louis Coyle and it could be Elder or it could be Aliar and the left wing back. And then midfield three of two fans, Seri and Slater and then I've got Oscar and Aliar up front. Or if Aliar goes to the left wing back then it could be Tyler Smith or Benjamin Tete coming in to replace him. But that's the formation we used in the last game, I think. It was a shot up will stick with his team. So let's move on to the next part of the video. So I predicted a Hull City 2-1 win on game two. I think Aliar and Oscar will score with Preston. I'll go for Troy Parrott, the goal scorers. Now let's move on to the next part. So yeah, um, that's the team news. And, you know, the next part of the video is we're going to get some Preston fan thoughts on going into the game. And this is going to be coming from Harvey, who was on the review video, I think, for one of the Preston Hall games last season. Um, so yeah, his link will be in the description down below, so don't forget to check him out. Um, and yeah, take it away, Harvey. Hi everyone, so today I've been asked to do um, a review video for the upcoming game this weekend against Hull City. Um, obviously... The results last season, the whole winning 4-1 against us in the opening game and us beating, I think it was 2-0, 2-1 last season. Um, obviously, major changes to both teams since then, obviously in the new season. Um, Preston with the new signings of, obviously, Freddie Woodman, Troy Parrott, Fernandez, Woodburn, etc., uh, And Hull with a few good signings, obviously, they've got the likes of a few turkey players. I'm not too keen on who they are or the names or anything like that. But um yeah, obviously last weekend Preston drawing their opening game nil nil. Obviously arguably first half Preston were the better team, had two really good chances with Troy Parrot and Emil Reese, but great save from the Wigan goalie. Double save. And um yeah, Hull with a two one win I think it was at the weekend. Very controversial penalty. Um some dodgy refereeing in that. But, yeah, um, my thoughts so far, obviously we're only one game in. You know, there's not exactly something to comment on. Um, we we looked a bit flat at times in the opening game. Um, in some areas we could obviously improve on, some areas I think we look good in. I think a few new signings for Preston is probably needed, maybe one or two, just to... Like add a bit more depth in the positions where we're a bit weak, and Hull, yeah, obviously Hull winning 
Um, they're going to be going into this game with a lot of momentum. Uh, where do I think, in terms of where I think Preston will go this season, probably, you know, you have to be realistic. I think we'll finish mid-table, 10th, 9th, um, depending on how the windows go. If we can get, like like I say, two more faces in or someone like in the in the January transfer window, if we have the money, then maybe I could see us maybe just edging, just missing out on the playoffs, 7, 8th. But yeah, nothing special. Uh, and Hull, I can, I can, if the managing goes right and the player style is fit well, I can see them doing really well this season. Um, maybe like again top ten. But yeah, uh, I'm looking forward to the game at the weekend. Hopefully, I should be able to go. Prediction. Hmm. I'm gonna go with. I'm gonna say two two. I think Hull looks strong, but I think Ryan Law has the areas that he knows he needs to improve on, and he's gonna improve on them areas. Players to look out for, I'd probably say Ben Whiteman, really good with his passes, midfield area, dead strong. McCann, if he plays, obviously Brian Lowe isn't keen on playing him, unless at wing back, which he's not used to. Troy Parrott, obviously, Spurs Loney, um, had a few good spells at Wigan, but just yet to find his feet a little bit, obviously only one game in. And obviously Emil Reese. Robbie Brady is a really good shout as well. On that left hand side, he's explosive, really well. Like played. Um gets crosses in really well. And yeah, that's it. I'm gonna go with the two two. Hopefully it should be a good game at the weekend. Thanks, Garen. And so yeah, that is it from Harvey and that is it for the preview video um for today. Um Again, just want to say a big thanks for everyone watching this at the minute and make sure you please leave a like comment and subscribe to my channel and don't forget to check out Harvey out as well um, his social media links YouTube will be in the description down below so don't forget to check that out and if you do subscribe to my channel then don't forget to press the notification bell as these preview videos and review videos will be coming out maybe a couple of days before a game or and the reviews maybe like the same day as the game or the, just the day after so make sure you keep tuned um, and yeah if you do want to watch these previews and reviews from this season there is a playlist preview reviews 2022-23 and if you want to watch the ones from last season if you missed any then the playlist is uh, preview and reviews 2021-22 um, so yeah if you want to keep updated just press the notification bell and you will be updated. But for, apart from that, that has been everything. Thank you guys for watching. I've been Ken Webster and I'll see you very soon. Peace.